Pick submit. And then. That's fun. There it is. There you go. The moment couldn't be any better. It's important to have it. It's a very important uh, contrast to what you usually see. Right at the base we have an enslaved ancestor followed by a union soldier who's been lynched and on top of that we have a protesting woman with her baby at her back. The enslaved ancestor gives support to the union soldier who also gives support to the next generation being the, the mother who is protesting who is also supporting her, her son uh, with the hopes that her protest will create a brighter future for her, her children. Everybody has a voice, everybody has an opinion, and the statue is designed to spark conversation. The artist Kwame Akoto Bamfo created the statue to basically do that, to start conversation, and it allows the, the audience or the people who see the statue to interact with it and say whatever they want to say, whatever's on their mind, or whatever the statue makes them feel. It's particularly interesting for me and significant to see a black woman at the top of this monument because it highlights the often ignored and often forgotten histories of black women within the transnational struggles for independence, for equality, amongst other things. We don't have stuff like this in Oregon. We don't have people talking about what this country has done to black people and this piece really shows that it's not holding anything back and I've always felt that people need to stop treading lightly around this subject because what we have done to black people in this country is beyond horrific.